This is going to be a review on the Patagonia Lightweight Travel Tote Backpack. It looks like this. I got it in black because I wanted to get a color that I could possibly use on work trips as well. And what it is, it is a tote bag like this. Oh, it's a little, it's a little messy. Hold on, let me just. It's a tote bag that you can hold like this, and you can convert to a backpack when you're done. So I just wanted to make a YouTube video showing all the details close up because I had a hard time finding that footage available when I was thinking about buying this bag. So here you have a, in the back, a compartment for hiding your backpack straps if you want a cleaner look. It's just very easy to unbuckle this. You can also fit a 13 inch laptop in here and then this goes on the side here inside of the main compartment looks like this uh, it has this one separate mini pouch that you can actually roll up the entire backpack and put it all inside of this pouch in the front you have one separate compartment that's Pretty big. You can fit a Kindle, your phone, passport, a book. Uh, each side there is one water bottle holder and a compression strap, which I look for in a backpack. That way I can use it to hook things on here if needed. Also, in the back that I forgot to mention, for those thinking about buying it is that the straps have these little I don't know how to call it these little things that you can hook whatever you want on your keys maybe you have a headphones something like that yeah and it's retail six uh, sorry, it retails $79. I bought it for about 60 bucks because I got it on sale. Um, I think it's okay for what I got it for. I think that there's a lot of good reviews on it. However, I think this backpack is pretty like flimsy. It definitely won't keep its shape. You can see how it's like... And it just doesn't really work well as a work backpack. Because when you put your laptop, like if you have a bigger laptop or you have more than one and you want to put one in the big compartment, it kind of just like moves around here and it looks kind of weird when you wear it because it kind of droops down. Um, so I wouldn't recommend it for, for work even though I kind of bought it for that. Um, definitely wouldn't recommend this as your main backpack because it's just, uh, I don't know, it just feels a little bit awkward because it's so flimsy. But besides that, um, it does seem durable, somewhat water resistant, I believe. Um, and yeah, I just pretty much wanted to show it for anyone who was looking for closer or close ups of this backpack. That's it.